Russians expand combat zone by 70 kilometers in Kharkiv Oblast. Russian troops have expanded the area of combat actions by almost 70 kilometers, thus attempting to force Ukrainian troops to deploy additional brigades from the reserve. Oleksandr Sirsky, commander-in-chief of the armed forces, said this on social media. Sirsky stressed that due to the deteriorating situation in Ukraine's east, he has been working for several days in a row in units engaged in combat operations in Kharkiv Oblast. He said that the Russians had focused their main efforts on the Strelecha Lipsy front and the capture of Vovchansk, with further access to the settlement of Bilyi Kolodyaz and the launch of an offensive to the rear of Ukrainian troops. To this end, the Russians created and significantly strengthened their operational tactical group server, which included combat units of the 6th Army and 11th and 44th Army Corps. Sirsky noted that the Russians had launched an offensive much earlier than planned when they noticed Ukrainian troops being redeployed here, but they failed to break through our defences. Sirsky predicted heavy fighting and said the Russians were preparing for it. Under such circumstances, we must prevent further advancement of the enemy troops by steadily holding the occupied borders and positions, inflict maximum losses on them with strikes by aircraft, missile systems, artillery and tanks, and create conditions for their defeat by the actions of mobile assault groups and units with attacks to the flank and rear from different directions, Sirsky added. Sirsky stated that the Ukrainian army should make the most of its advantage in the attack UAVs, the use of electronic warfare and precise artillery fire. My work has been focused on these issues as well as on regrouping troops and simplifying the system of comprehensive support, he said. In addition, Sirsky worked in all the brigades fighting in Kharkiv Oblast, was in one of the battalions defending Vovchansk and made all the necessary decisions on the spot to ensure the sustainability and effectiveness of defense. He added that Kharkiv and Kharkiv Oblast residents are actively involved and helping the defense forces in any way they can. Сожгли, но все-таки, блин, да, что он все завалил, пришли посмотреть. Ну, моя каска сгоревшая. Ой. Короче, вот, сожгли нас полностью. Бабка, ешка, вот что она может. О, пиздец. Все, блин, даже все погорело. Скинул сюда, видим. Все у нас сгорело. Автомат у тебя сгорел, да, Хор? Да, БК все, 150, Бога сгорел, короче, все сгорел. Тырчик сгорел. Тырчик сгорел. Вот, самоходочку нашу уничтожили, вот он догорает. Мы идем мимо нее. Вот ствол. Какие-то 
обломки. Вот обломки. Ох, Серега!